Well, the former chairman of the party of national unity, PNU, Gideon Conchella, was officially received today by the leader of the United Republican Party, William Ruto, after he ditched the president's party on Thursday last week. Well, the Waipu Democratic Party, whose leader is Vice President Kalonzo Nsioka, was also a beneficiary of the ongoing party defections when it welcomed a section of councillors from Tana River County at the party's head office. On his part, the National Alliance presidential hopeful Uhuru Kenyatta was in Kangemi, Nairobi, where he urged the youth to be self-reliant while launching a motorcyclist purchase self soft loan scheme launched by the Toyota Kenya for border border taxi operators. At the URP party headquarters, the party's presidential aspirant William Ruto was on hand to officially receive former PNU chairman and Kilgoris lawmaker Gideon Conchella. Conchella ditched the president's party last Thursday, a few hours after signing a pre-election deal with Uhuru Kenyatta's party, the National Alliance. The PNU-TNA agreement bars the president's party from fielding candidates for elective positions in the upcoming general elections under its banner. The major deal directed all PNU supporters to register as members of TNA before the October 17th deadline. And as the deadline approached, Conchella was at URP offices after signing a deal some political pundits argued signaled the death of the president's party. URP long welcomed in its party forward former chairman of the Waipa Democratic Party, Samuel Poisio. And this is how Conchella defended his action to ditch the president's party and pitch camp at URP. Leaders of substance, leaders who mean well for this nation, stand up to be counted. And you can only be counted if you stand in a party, in a process that is transparent, that is accountable to the people, that will deliver the, the wishes and the cry of the people of Kenya. At the Waipo Democratic Party offices, Vice President Kalonzo Musioka was also in the mood of welcoming defectors. This time round, it was a team of councillors from Tana River County. Kalonzo, who will be contesting the presidency on Waipa ticket, also welcomed a group of youth who want to rally support for the party ahead of the polls. Karibuni sana na wale ambao umetoka vyama mbalimbali Kanu, Kadu, ODM tunawakaribishieni sana. Deputy Prime Minister and TNA Presidential Hopeful Uhuru Kenyatta was at Kangemi during the launch of a soft loan scheme by Toyota Kenya for Yamaha motorcycles for border border taxi operators. Uhuru urged the youth to buy the motorcycles while they'll be required to pay 350 shillings per day from their earnings until they clear the debt. Taifa letu la Kenya vijana ndiyo wengi na bado vijana ndiyo wanamebeba mzigo mkubwa ndiyo wako na shida nyingi na katikati ya mambo haya yote hawana kazi And from Kericho County the Prime Minister's wife Aida Odinga urged women not to be swayed by the political waves currently being witnessed as parties realign to succeed President Kibaki I'm a very consistent person Na nataka nyinyi pia musibanduke. Si ya kwamba leo upepo naenda from north to south. Na kutoka left to right unaenda right. Kesho ikienda north to south unaenda south. All players who have expressed interest to succeed Kibaki have talked of forging mergers with like-minded parties. But inherent suspicions and experiences in coalition politics have seen party leaders and their supporters divided on whether to cut the deals before or after the elections. Patrick Amimo, KTN Prime.